It meant life to him. 14-year-old Brock B. Rock Johnson, a teen who recently died after a long struggle with a rare autoimmune disease. I was a good friends with him. Um, I saw him at the batting cages, saw him in praxis. 11-year-old A.J. Raber even recalls seeing his friend pick up a bat to practice right after one of his many stays in the hospital. Yeah, he was a great kid. So great that the courage Brock exemplified during his last days on Earth left quite the imprint. He was such an old soul for a kid. I mean, he just got it. You could see what his father, Terry Johnson, means almost everywhere you turned at the inaugural Brock Strong baseball tournament in Canal Winchester. Whether it was Brock's favorite scripture. It says, Be Rock Strong, 2 Timothy, chapter 4, verse 7. Or one of his sayings. You have your bad days and you have your good days. You just got to fight. And that's Brock's actual signature. A legacy that touched hundreds of people who donated to the Brock Strong Foundation and Brock's peers who, on this day, played in his honor. As my coach said, that son is basically him staring down on us. That to me speaks volumes of the of the character of a little 14 and a half year old boy that somebody would want to to permanently stand Brock Strong. A character trait that's caught on. It's a great opportunity to play like him and be like him. And continues to grow. We could easily go to bed and not get out of bed and be sad all the time, but that wouldn't glorify him at all. That's not what he would want. This is what his family and friends say he'd want. At the end of the day, families hope to raise about $10,000 to go to the Brock Strong Foundation where they'll be able to provide scholarships for some of the baseball players that you saw out here today or also help families who have children in Nationwide Children's Hospital. Reporting in Canal Winchester, Liz Adiola, NBC4.